What's going on everyone? This is Lorenz and today we're going to be unboxing a telescope. Uh, today I have a Sky Raider 66mm refractor telescope. This is a doublet ED Apo. Uh, comes with a star diagonal and an eyepiece so kind of imaging and uh, small portable observing ready to go. Without further ado, let's go ahead and uh, get started with the unboxing, shall we? So this telescope also comes with a carry case, so right away I see the carry case. Alright, case is now out of the box, let's go ahead and see what we have inside. Alright, so one eyepiece, one star diagonal. One refractor telescope. So there's some extra foam cut out here, foam here, and there's a couple over here too. So, but really just big enough to store everything that's included. I'm gonna set this off to the side for now. Okay, now that we have everything out of the case, let's go ahead and unwrap each item. First, we'll do the eyepiece. Twelve point five millimeter long eye relief, fully multi-coated eyepiece. We have dust caps on both ends, fold down rubber eye guard. Nice eyepiece. Up next we have the star diagonal. So this is a 1.25 inch, 90 degree mirror star diagonal. This has the dielectric coatings on it. Uh, we have dust covers on both ends here. I'm gonna take those out. And on the insert we have a brass compression ring. So when you insert the eyepiece or any other accessories, it won't mar up the surface from the thumb screw and it'll evenly clamp it. So uh, it kind of secures it with more confidence. Very nice diagonal. And finally, we have the telescope, so let me get these two out of the way. All right. Alright, so now we have the Sky Raider 66mm itself. Let's go ahead and start at the front of the scope. So we have the front lens, objective lens cover here. Um, this is made of metal, uh, felt lined on the inside, so it just slides right on and off. Very nice dust cover. Now we have the dew shield. So this dew shield is uh, telescoping, right? We could extend it like so. When you're using it out in the field, you're going to want to extend that dew shield just to prevent any stray light and especially to prevent dew from accumulating on the front lens of the telescope. Pull that back down. And then we have the uh, dovetail rail here. So um, uh, this will match onto any telescope mount that accepts a Vixen style dovetail rail, which is most telescope mounts. Um, uh, if you want to add a riser block or uh, like a longer dovetail bar here, there are threaded quarter 20 holes, so you could easily add like a riser block set or another dovetail bar right there to extend the uh, balancing room, especially for astro imaging purposes. Uh, right above that dovetail rail, we have the uh, rotating focuser. So you could loosen that thumb screw and that allows you to rotate the focuser. However, I'll probably just mostly use it uh, kind of like home position, how it was pulled out of the box. 
um, but it's really just preference. Going further down, we have the focuser. So this is a 10-1 speed focuser. It's most refractors that you know have a 10-1 speed come with one of these covers, so you just pull that right off. Uh, and then here uh, we have the locking screw. We're going to go ahead and loosen that. Right, you want to make sure that's loose when you're focusing the telescope, because if that's locked into place, it won't really focus that well. There we go. So that works really good. And I could see it barely moving when I use the micro focus. So once you get a nice clear image, you just lock it into place with the thumb screw. And then at the back of the scope here, I'm going to get a firm grip. At the back of the scope, we have a two inch and inch and a quarter openings. So there we go. Loosen the thumb screw, brass compression ring. Very nice to see. And then we have the inch and a quarter opening again, brass compression ring. Very nice to see. Oh yeah, and then the, how can you forget, we have the Sky Raider logo here on the side of the dew shield. Very nice, I like it. It's got a little spaceman on it. Alrighty folks, that's gonna wrap up today's unboxing video. Feel free to leave a comment down below. I'm happy to hear your feedback or any recommendations you may have for a future video. We'll definitely be doing more unboxings in the future. I've got some optional accessories over there for the Sky Raider telescope. Man, I'm super excited to start using this thing. Uh, if you want to know more information about this telescope, go to octelescope.com. I'll leave a link in the description for you so you can check it out. Uh, Till next time, clear skies.